Are we ready? Are we ready? Okay. The ease of doing this business. Now, we get started. Make sure you're not distracted. Make sure you're not. Certain things I would like us to note. Now, this is not going to be a long training, a very short one. You see, even the federal government tries to, I think there's a legislation on the ease of doing business, right? For small and medium scale enterprises, SMA. So that means that there's usually something that can enable anybody who should be an entrepreneur. There's usually something that can enable you run your business with ease run your business with ease. It could be providing an enabling environment. So you see the federal government tries to provide enabling environment to help small scale businesses to thrive. The, the, the federal government tries to, or the government tries to provide loans, soft loans, grants. And the goal is to help ease doing business, especially for, for, um, for medium scale businesses. So meaning that there's a role that could be played that can make running a business easy for someone, simple for someone. And it means that if these rules are not played, doing business could be what? Could be difficult. Running business could be difficult. Now, in our business, this business you just got started, you keyed into a lot of persons find doing this business difficult and daunting. Some persons will be like, man, this business is difficult. This business is daunting, man. I'm draining. I'm trying, but this thing doesn't seem to be working. A lot of people are finding it difficult to do this business. If you are such a person, you are finding it difficult to do this business, type me. Type me. Like sometimes you just sit down and you wonder, why is this business so difficult? Why is this business so difficult? This business seems to be difficult. I see everything I am doing. Ah, man, you can see a lot of persons are saying it is, wow, they find it difficult. Many find it, this business difficult. Hmm. Keep your comments coming. You will see them. Aha, uh -huh. people are confessing now. Ah, I find this business difficult. In fact, the only reason I'm still doing this business is just because my money is tied to it. My money is tied to this business. If not, eh, when I know you see me here, the only reason I'm here is because I'm still trying to what? I am still trying to recover back my funds. Can I tell you something, everyone? Can I tell you something, everyone? Can I tell you something? Let me tell you this. It shouldn't be. It shouldn't be. Oh, you've gone too far to quit. Thank you very much. It shouldn't be. It shouldn't be that you are finding this business difficult. It shouldn't be. Hmm. Do you know that if we should X-ray it now, what is even your definition of difficult? What is difficult? What do you see as difficult? But then you see, it shouldn't be, you shouldn't be finding this business difficult. You know why? This business is simple. Even though it is not easy, it is simple. 
it is simple. This business is simple. This business is not difficult. This business is simple, even though it is not easy. You know why? Because there is nothing that is easy in this life. Is it easy to get wife to marry? Is it easy to find a job? Is it easy to make money? Is it easy to go to heaven? Is it, is it easy? Is it easy to get a child, to have a child? Is it easy? Is, is there anything that is easy in this life? There's nothing that is easy in this life. So if you are looking for ease, you will never succeed. If that is your definition of difficulty, oh, I expected to just be making money with ease. There is nothing easy. But this business is simple. This business is not difficult. This business is simple. I can tell you, listen, listen, I've done a lot of things in this life, trying to make money. As young as I am, I've tried out my hands on swimming. In fact, I think one day I'm going to do a training on my entrepreneurial journey. Nobody today I start. Nobody today I start. Do you understand? I've tried a lot of things. I've, I've been an adventurous person in terms of making money. And let me tell you something from my experience, my little experience, you know, I have found that, that this is the easiest business I've ever done to make money. This is the easiest thing I've ever done to make money. I'm oh, sorry, the simplest thing rather, not the easiest rather. The simplest business I have ever done to make money. It's not easy, but it's the simplest I've ever done. Are you with me? So this business is actually what is simple. It's not meant to be difficult. It is not easy, but it's not difficult, right? So what does that mean? That if you are finding this business difficult, not that you are expecting ease, there is something you don't know or there's something you are not doing. Simple. Hmm. Hmm. The ease of doing this business. I came here to reveal to you a secret you already know that will make it easier for you to build this business. That will make it simpler rather for you to do this business. So if you are doing what? If you are finding this business difficult, not easy. If you are, doing, you are finding this business difficult, there's something you don't know or there's something you are not doing. That is, see, that, that, this is the summary of everything that this cell meeting it is, is all about. So when you begin to experience difficulty, how do you know? How do you know you are experiencing difficulty? How do you know? When you are seeing the same thing you are doing, not producing the desired results, right? But someone else is doing the same thing, but getting a better result or getting the desired result, then that means that it is difficult to you, but it is easy to the other person. For example, is mathematics difficult? Is mathematics difficult? Is mathematics difficult? Is mathematics difficult? Is a yes or no answer? Whether yes, or you have to choose one. Is mathematics difficult? You see now, I am dividing the house now. Right? You see that? You see that? How many of you believe that mathematics is the easiest, is the simplest course on earth? <laughs> right? Mathematics is the simplest course. You know, some people are crying right now because they know what they went through in school. Right? That you were not passing mathematics. Does that mean that mathematics is difficult? Is that, some of you, right? Have you not gone back to your math? That math that was breaking your head to be. 
that time, that much. How many of you have tried going back to your textbook and you are like, is this what was giving me headache before? Right? 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 I didn't say it is the easiest one. I say it's the simplest. Right? Right? Some of you, have you gone back? Have you gone back? Have you gone back to that your textbook? Even for that mass, right? Do you know that some of you, they give you for that? You'll be like, wait, 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 wait. Is this what was giving me headache that time? So do you know that this the mathematics is the simplest? Because do you know why? Because mathematics is A and B. It's just plug and play. Once you know the formula, the problem is that we did not understand the formula. You, If you don't understand the formula, it becomes difficult for you. But mathematics is the simplest. Is the simplest. You don't need to speak grammar. You see all this, this English you are speaking, whether you are, they will not be checking your spelling, whether your spelling is correct. Nobody checks your spelling in mathematics. Nobody checks whether you are using punctuation marks in mathematics. Nobody checks your handwriting. Do you understand what I'm talking about? It is simple. Once you know it, plug and play. Do you know that once you know the, the, the logic, you know everything, guess what? You can finish writing a mathematics exam in a few minutes. What to me the most difficult subject is English. You see that they'll tell you like a write, they tell you write an essay. You have to start thinking and you stay there. You are composing something. You will write English when you are answering English question. You write like five pages. You are answering one question. Five pages. My what is you just pa 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 pa. I get it. All right. Mm -hmm. Anyway, we are not here to debate. So it is actually simple. If you are finding what, if you are finding mathematics difficult, it means that there is something you are supposed to know that you don't know. So I'm trying to make what, I'm trying to make this, this, this thing drive home. I want to drive home the point. If you are finding this business difficult, there is something you don't know or something you are not doing. Simple, because this business is not difficult. So what does that mean? If you want this business to be simple for you, you need to find out what am I not doing right? What do I need to know that I don't know yet? That's the only thing that is complicating your business for you. That's the only reason you are finding what is simple difficult because you have not known what you're supposed to know or you are not doing what you're supposed to do. This is the two reasons you are finding this business difficult. Any one of them. Right? Right? Do you understand? Do you understand? Right? So if you are finding it, Find out what do I need to know? What have I not known that I'm supposed to know? What am I supposed to be doing? And let me tell you the truth. A lot of you who are struggling in this, those of you who are struggling, you have not started doing the things you are supposed to do. You think you are doing, you know, some of us are deceived by the fact that we come to the office. You say, ah, but I come to the office every day now. I attend all the trainings now. Now you already know, but the problem is that you are not doing and if I should sit down with you, you know, if I ask how many of you, how many of you made money? How many of you made money? And those of you who say, ah, I did not make money. Do you know that if I sit down with you in 30 minutes, you will know why you are be making money. And it is one of these two things. It is either because you are not doing what you know you are supposed to do, or what you're supposed to do, you, are, you don't even know what you're supposed to do. Hmm. Do you understand? Do you understand? Right? More of the same. Let's make progress. Let's make progress. The ease of doing this business. The ease of doing this business. This business has been simplified. Two things have simplified our easy, our business. Right? There are two things that has made this business very easy. You know, I keep saying it. I've done network marketing before. I did network marketing before. And guys, I struggled, like I struggled for six good months. I, I couldn't sign up one single human, not even part payment. Not even part payment. It was that bad. 
It was that bad. I couldn't sign up in six good months. So six good months. But how come I now signed up into this same another network marketing company? Guess what? And it's like with just a clip of the finger like this, a snap of the finger like this. Oh more, I am already what? Pa, 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 pa. People in two weeks, I got what I could not do. Now, you see, if I was to judge network marketing by my previous experience, I would say that it was so difficult. I tried everything. It did not work. But in this one, in three, in two weeks, I had already gotten three signups. In two weeks, what I couldn't get in, I couldn't even get one third of that in six months. Now, do you know I started discovering why I did not succeed in my previous network marketing experience. While I was doing this, I started discovering, guess what? There were a lot of things I did not know then. That time, I was just busy. I was just busy prospecting people. I never read a book. I didn't read any book on network marketing then. There was no training in that network marketing company. There was no training. There was no mentorship. There was nothing. How was I expecting it to be easy? How was I expecting it to be simple? You see, something can be simplified when there is somebody teaching you. Now, the reason mathematics can be simple for somebody is because there is a teacher who is teaching you math. Do you know that some of us would have understood math better, but because we did not have a good teacher that was teaching us mathematics? Is that true or yes? Is that true or yes? You see it now. So because nobody taught you mathematics very well, right? You begin to feel you failed it. And then you begin to feel that mathematics is actually what? It's not, it's not what? It's difficult. Nobody taught you. Nobody taught you how to do maths, right? And of course, also, if you don't learn the formulas, there are formulas in mathematics. If you want to learn the maths and get it simplified, you need to know the formulas. So that when you see a question, you ask yourself, is this a quadratic equation? Or is this so, 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 and so? Is it this one, this one? Which kind of equation is this one? Once you know the formula to solve the problem, what happens? It becomes my mind for you. It becomes my mind for you. So it is either of these two problems. So when you are saying mathematics is difficult, it is either any one of these um, um, problem um, um, issues. One, it is either you don't know the formula to apply to solve this mathematical problem. So you see, when you lack the knowledge, no matter how much the time you spend, you will never be able to solve that problem. Why? Because you don't know anything about it. Number two, why wouldn't you know? Why don't you know? Number two could be because there was nobody who taught you. No one who taught you that particular formula that you can use to solve the problem. So you see, if these two things are in place, you will find mathematics simple. If there is a good teacher who knows what he is doing that teaches you the formulas well, guess what? You When somebody is saying that mathematics is difficult, you say, which mathematics is that? Which mathematics is that? And you'll be solving the problems. Listen to me, mathematics has nothing to do with your talent. Anybody, everybody can be very good with maths anybody all you need to do is to learn it might take you different times it might take another person a a, a a longer time to learn the same thing it might take another person a shorter time to learn the same thing but at the end of the day all of them do it anybody if a parent here do not believe the lie that my child is not good at mathematics it is not true it is not true most times it is the teacher who is actually not teaching well who is not communicating well most times most times even that child that seems to be as if his head is blocked, give him time. It's just a matter of time. And then consistency, it will break. 
And I'm not giving parenting tips this morning. So two things that have simplified this business and has made this business simple, unlike every other network marketing businesses you will ever do or any other business you will ever do. Number one is what? Use the system. Hmm. Use the system. The system has simplified this business. The other one is what? Submit to mentorship. Do you know that the most difficult things are actually the most simplest things? Or rather, the most simplest things are actually the most difficult things. Yeah. The simplest things are usually the most difficult. Do you know why? Because human beings find it difficult to apply simple things. Human beings find it difficult to apply simple things. You see, they find it difficult. So they are like, huh? I, I just, I just, I just use the system and I just get down like that. No, 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 no. It's supposed to be more difficult than this. Some people are like, it's supposed to be more. How can I? just by just by submitting contact list, just by organizing people together, and I will start making money. No, it's supposed to be more difficult than. are succeeding at the snap of a finger. Hmm. But you know the problem we have. Those of us who are saying that this business is difficult, you are lacking at least in one of these two. That is why. That's what I came here to open your eyes to. I came here to simplify this business for somebody. Explain to me what a child, like, what a young girl rather, of 21 year old, 21 year old lady, 20, 21 year old, explain to me how simple it can be for a young lady of 20 years old to have built a house for her mother. Explain to me if that is not easy, what is that? If that is not simple, what is that? What is it that can make a young girl of 20 years old to own her own Mercedes Benz? He's already counting in millions at the age of 20. Please tell me, if it is not a business that is simple, what is it that can help a young lady do that? You think it, you think it is that easy to make money? You think it is that simple to make money? That a 20-year-old can be making enough money to even build a house for her mother. Build a house. At the age of 20, Abba, if it were that simple now, how, how are we going to be talking about what? Right? Right? If it is not simple, how can she be have bought that kind of car at the age of 20? So you see, there is something that she is doing. There is something that she knows that she is applying that is giving her that. And let me tell you the truth. They are just these two simple things. Use the system. Please follow me this morning because this morning we deliver some people. Very simple, this is all I came here to discuss. The system, method. that is all I came here to discuss. But if you can open your eyes, somebody will be delivered from difficulty this morning. Something is going to drop out of that. Some of you, this is the reason you have been struggling. This is what you have been struggling with. This is why you have been struggling. A system has been provided. Your job is to use the system. Your job is not to invent the system. <laughs> Your job is to use the system. Your job is not to invent the system. It's not to reinvent the system. Listen. The beauty of this business is simplicity. Hmm. That's the beauty of this business. The beauty of this business is the simplicity with which we are building. 
the simplicity. But you know what? This system simplifies the business. But some of us are trying to do what? To complicate the, the, the system or the business. Hmm. You see, it? the system is the tracks that have been given to you to run on. Hmm. You see, we are on a race to financial freedom. And this is the track. This is the track. This is the track you should run on so that you can get to your desired destination. But some of us are saying, no, no, no. This track is too straight. It's too straight. In a real, in a real, uh, 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 this thing, in a real uh, 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 race, the track should be bent. It should be windy. It should be, you know, there should be curves and detours and the rest of them. So that at least the more difficult it is, the greater the crown, right? So some of us say, no, 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 no. This track you're giving me is too straight. It's too straight. So instead of this, no, let me run through the bush. I want to run through. There should be obstacles. There should be this one. There should be the other one. And you are the one creating bombs for yourself. You are not running on the track. Let me tell you something. You see this system we are working with. This system has produced billionaires. All they did was follow the system. But do you know what we have? Some of you come into the business and you begin to question the system. Some people begin to question the system. You come into the business. They tell you, this is our system. Follow this system. Make a list of your contacts and submit to us. Is there anything difficult in writing a contact list? Tell me. Is there anything difficult in writing it out and submitting? Some persons will say, no. Why must I write it out? These people are my people. All I need to do is for me to call them. Say it's for them to come here. Don't worry. I am going to bring them. Nobody taught you to bring them. Nobody told you to bring anybody. We told you, write a contact list. Just write it out. There are some people listening to this. Today, they have not written contact list. Yet, they say that the business is difficult. Don't talk. You don't need to explain anything to anybody. Take this text message. Send the text message to them. Somebody is arguing with you and is telling you, why will I write somebody's name? I need to talk to the person first before I will write his name. I need to call the person and tell him, see you, I am somewhere now. They told me to write people's contact. I, I want to find out from you. Should I write your contact or not? I need to take your permission. That is not the system. But somebody said, eh, but that is the right thing to do now. You have been doing the right things. How, many, how much have you made in your own way? I mean, in your own way, the right things. Say, but that's the right. I need to take permission from the person. The person, I need to write. What, why are you now sending the text message? Why are you now sending the text message? They say, no, I need to call them first before I write their names. They have started complicating the process. Write down their names. Take this text message. Send the text message to them. That text message I said is to notify them that you wrote down their names. Are you with me now? But somebody will be arguing with that. We say, why must I send them text? Must I send them text? Can't you people call them without me sending them text message? And there are some persons who they came into the business. They did how many accounts? The only reason they are not doing that is because they don't want to send text messages. Why don't you? I don't want them to know that I'm the one that wrote that. Then how do you expect? And then the person goes back and says, I don't understand why my business is double. I just invested my money and then nothing is working. That's what they're saying. You see, you have started complicating the process. This business is simple. Write the list, send the list. We told you, this is the text message to send. This particular text message, send this text message to them. 
send this text message to them. This one, as it is written like this, hello, I, I, there's a, there is a what? There's a global project that you do. enterprise individuals. And I recommended you for their partnership. Simple, send it to all of them. Somebody starts questioning, why must it be this text message I should send? Which one is global development group again? Enterprising individuals. No, these people are mine. Let me just say, see, I sent your number to some people. They are going to call you. That is easy. And some people have started changing. They say, no, 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 I don't like this thing they said. Yet. I don't, why must it be this? Why must it be that? And from there, from there, they will change everything. They say, no, this is not what I'm going to send. In fact, must I even send text? I want to call all of them. I want to call all of them. <laughs> hello, hello. There's this business I just joined. They say I should write down the name of people. I wrote down your name. Eh? Please, when they call you, please make sure you go. Eh? Make sure you go. Eh? Make sure they are going to call you. The person starts now asking you, which business is that? See, which business is that? That's nice. Hey, it's one business. Who, it's one business. Who, you see, there is a reason we said it should be text me, not call. You know why? Because when you are on call, anybody can ask you questions. Anybody can get you to explain what you are not supposed to explain. The, but because you're already on phone with them, they will start pressing you. Hey, hey, what be, explain what exactly do they do? Hey, you say five business. So I don't, it's just my friend that invited me. I went to the uh, seminar. And then I saw ah, they, they actually making money. They actually making money. The beginning of failure, right? The beginning of failure. There is a system. Send the text. That is all. When you send the text, when they call you back, this is the response you should give. This is the response you should give when they call you back. Somebody is already quarreling. Why must I? Why must I respond? Why must it be this thing? Why are you people telling us what to respond? You see that your why, why, why you have certain complications. Imagine they told you this is a quadratic equation. This is the formula to you. You start questioning why is it this formula? Why must I use this formula? Can't I use another formula and still get? And that's how you got F nine in in mathematics in one year. Because you were asking too much questions when you are supposed to take something and run with it. Why must I respond? Why must you people tell us what to respond? Why must you tell us what to respond? Hmm? Right? So when they call you, we have given you a response. We gave you a response to respond. Do you understand? Right? We have given you, say, when they call you back, say these things. What is difficult? Can you imagine? You are going to write an exam. And in that exam, they gave you the answer. They gave you the answer. They say, enter this exam with this answer. With this answer, it is written. You know, <laughs> you know why I said the simplest things are the most difficult things? You know why? Imagine that you are going for an exam. Right, and then the what the 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 lecturer gave you the answer. I say carry this answer, enter the exam hall. The questions I'm going to ask you, the answer is this. Thing. Take it, go and write it like that. Do you know what somebody? Do you know what some of you? Some of you will start suspecting that our lecturer. <laughs> this one that this might give me the answer to enter. This is not the answer to this thing. So you will not be inside with the answer. Guess what? You will not start suspecting. And because of that, you will not start looking for another thing to write. Say, this one way, this one give me answer to enter. This is the only, this is the only exam. You will enter exam hall and they are giving you the answer already. Say, carry this word, carry this question, answer. Go inside and answer it like that. That's why some human beings will start saying, no, this cannot be that. This guy does not love me too much to be giving me answer to enter exam hall with it. <laughs> <laughs> that's what is happening to some of us in the business we are already giving you the expo we say see these people are going to call you back after you have done what after you have sent the text message when they call you back this is what to answer in fact you don't need to cram it on your brain all you just need to do read it out 
You th- we don't write it down, write it down. Hold it. When they start calling you back, be reading it out as you are responding. For heaven's sake, what can be as difficult as that? For heaven's sake, what can be as difficult as that? And somebody will be holding it to, he say, write it down. He will not write it down. He say, bring it out and read out while you are saying, he will not read. He will not do it. He will just answer, hey, hello, hello. Uh-huh. Okay, you receive my text message. Uh-huh. I read your text message. What, what is that? No, it's not my message. You will like him. You will like him. It's a better business. It's not all like that, like that too. Ah, no, this one is different. It's not like that other one that you did, that we did together. This one is different. This one is good. They are making money. Hmm. Hmm. And you will use your hand, spoil your soup, and you are crying that the soup is not sweet. You see, most of you, right? This is what you did. At your first contact with this was what you did. You used your mouth, spoil, simple thing. Carry this thing, write it out, read it, read it as they are talking. Just be reading it as they are calling you. As simple as that. Right? As simple as that. Yet, people find it difficult to follow. Then when you finish bastardizing with your response, unprofessional responses, you now get the outcome. Nobody shows up. You begin to cry. Ah, I tell you that this business does not work. They told me to I submitted all my contacts. Nobody came. No sign up. No this one. No the other one. Use the system. Some people begin to question the system. Begin to, you see, gather people together. Invite them to your house. Don't explain anything to them. This is the text message to send to them to invite them to your house. Just what? I am having a get together for my friends. I am having a get together for my friends, right? And I'm inviting some dignitaries to come over as well. Will you be in town? Let me make plans for you. Somebody's already shot. Started questioning. <laughs> Which one is get together again? Am I throwing a party? I'm not planning to throw a party. Now, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Hmm. Now, I told, when I was doing my last home lunch in the month of July, I mean the month of June, I invited my friends. I called some of them, right? I called some of them. I said, how? Oh, no, I sent them text message, brother. I sent them a text. Say, Alpha, I'm inviting you for my get together, so so and so and so by this time. And then, look at me, me as as at least with this my level of success. I still have to follow the system. I sent them. I sent them. I sent them the text. Some of them were calling me. They were calling me, and when they were calling me, I hope the network is good, right? Uh, I hope you can all hear me. So I'm seeing some persons complain about uh, um, um, the, uh, the sound. I hope you can hear me loud and clear. Please. Okay, you can hear me. All right, beautiful. So it's your own network. So some of them called me. Some of them called me and they were like, Moses Alpha, say so which uh, which uh, get together are you planning? As in, is it your child? Is it uh, whichever? I said, no, it's not my child or anything. They said, what exactly are you doing in the get together? Do you know what I told them? I simply told them. I simply told them, I am celebrating friendship. I am celebrating friendship. Simple. Must it be when you are getting married that you are being get together? Must it be birthday that you are being get together? Must it be? I said, I am celebrating friendship. Simple. You can come. Is it bad for me to celebrate my friends together? What is get together? Friends getting together in a particular environment. Is that not get together? Is that not get together? That is all. So come on, if you want to be, if you want to celebrate friendship, please, you can come together. That's why I'm inviting you so that we can celebrate friendship. Is friendship not enough to be celebrated? Simple and short. Are you with me now? Are you with me now? And those are the game. Some of them signed up. Of course, not everybody signed up. Follow the system. Some of you are complicated. You say, okay, what are you getting together for? Eh, is one, there's one business who there are people are coming. They are coming to come and teach us how to make money. 
with business which which kind of what kind of business is that then now you have to what you have to start thinking you have to start thinking you have to start thinking of what to say you have to start thinking of what to say what kind of business how do i explain this business and they actually eh, they even they told me not to say anything about the business but you can come sir. just come to my house when you come they will answer you they will tell they will show you they will show you they told me not to say anything about the business is that part of the system is that part of the system somebody is asking who presented it by home loans i presented myself i invited people to my home loans i did the presentation myself ha. no time more do you understand at least at this level they already see they know my success already i i brought them together i said guys i'm showing you what has helped me the last five years last four years I came here to review. Some of you know what I am what, know why I am I am this success. I want to show you that in the time. You are seeing my pictures. I'm traveling up and down. I'm traveling around. I say, let me show you where the money is coming from. I presented to them, close them down, signed up. Are you with me now? They signed up. So some of us, we are using our hands and we are destroying our business. This is the same system that has done what? That has produced multi-millionaires. And somebody is questioning the system. Do you know that some people even want to, they want to change our what? They even want to change our, our, our slide, presentation slide. Ah, I used to have this, this man. I was trying to build his business that time. You know, I was trying to do the business that time. You know, the, the man is a big time contractor, does contracts for, you know, government and all that and all that. So he was telling me, see, you see, you see, this is your slide, this is your slide. It's good though, but you know, the caliber of people that I'm going to be bringing into the business, this slide is not, no, we need to, I need to change everything. You know, I need to change it. Let it fit the people that I'm going to be bringing in. I say, eh. Mm -hmm. Now, this doesn't mean, of course, there are different slides for different set of persons, yes? But some persons, see, you can try to edit the slide and you will edit the main things out of the slide. You see that? So some people are even questioning the slide. Some people are questioning everything. You see, when you catch yourself questioning everything, everything, every, why must it be like, what? you have started failing already. That is the beginning of failure. You begin to fail when you are trying to do this business your own way. I'm telling you, you will hit rock bottom. Like a lot of people have struck, they are struggling. And this is the very simple reason they are struggling. Simply follow the system. Use the system. Don't be the system. Use the system. Now, can I tell you something? Do you know why? Let me tell you something. Do you know why when you start this business, we tell you not to explain anything to anybody? Do you know why? It is actually going to be easier for me if you can actually explain to people this business and they sign up. It's easier for me. But you know why? You have not been trained. You have not been. There's a lot of things you don't know yet. You see, like me right now, as I am right now, I can prospect my business myself, my own contact. Jonathan, I can prospect my own contact. I can present to my own my own person. I can book them myself. I will present to them myself and they will still sign up. Why are we telling you, you not to do the same? Because you have not been trained. I have read books. I now understand what I'm supposed to say. I now know what I'm supposed to say. Somebody is quarreling, right? Right, you know, somebody is quarreling. Why must there be a script? Why must that, why why are you people telling me this particular thing? Why must it be this particular? If I say another thing, what is is it a problem? Let me ask you. Everything in this life has scripts. Even when you want to check a lady, you must use the right script. If you don't use the right script, ladies, what will happen? What will happen? Somebody they are telling you this is how to say it. Say, I love you. You are the sugar in my tea. You are the peppermint in my butter. You are the butter in my bread. If you don't use this script, you will not get her. And you are questioning, why must I use cocoa? Why must I say butter? Why must I say sugar in my tea? Why can't it be peppermint? Go and do the peppermint now. The lady will show you the result of the peppermint. Everything has scripts. 
Everything has script. Even Bible gets script. Quran gets script. Imagine that you want to talk to people to give their life to Christ. And when you go there, when you go there, while you are standing there and you are telling people, you are just condemning everybody. You are condemning every human being. Who go listen to your message? There is a script. There is a script to use. Every profession has a script. If you want to come and do fundraising in church, there's a script we use. Oh. If you know use the correct script, you know go get and she she, you know go get. Is that true or yes? Pastors. Right? 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 You have to do what? You have to follow the script. It is different script. That's why there is a system. Somebody just said it very, very true. Evil movies have script. Imagine that you are an actor. They gave you a role to play. And they gave you a Every role has a script. This is what to say. This is what we want you to say. For heaven's sake now, is that difficult? And who are the best actors, movie actors? The movie actors that can stick to their script that can interpret their script, those are the persons. But somebody is questioning, why must you tell us what to say? That is how life runs. You must know the right thing to say at the right time. If you don't, you will not get the desired result. Simple, QED, stop quarreling. That is why you are not succeeding. You are not succeeding because you are not following simple instructions. That is why business is difficult. We say when you are making the booking calls, this is the script to use to make the booking calls. Read it as you are making the call. For heaven's sake, what can be more difficult? What can be more difficult? What can be more difficult? This is the script. If you are going to give out questionnaires, this is the script. This is what to say when you are giving out questionnaire. But some persons will refuse to follow that simple instruction. They will refuse to follow that simple instruction. This is what to say. When you want to give a questionnaire, smile. Give a smile. When you smile, you tell, you introduce yourself. Then you do this. You do this. Some people will not go here. They will come out. Why must I stick to this? Is it not just to give? I've been sharing flyer before. I used to share. I work for one company where we used to share flyer. This is not how we do it. You now want to go and do it the way you have been doing it before. You just meet somebody, you give him something. No nothing, no anything. How do you expect to get the result? Use the system. Find out how to use each system. Stick to it, for heaven's sake. Stick to it. Stick to it. You will get the result. The reason most of us have been struggling to get results is that we have not been following the system. You have not been following the system. You have not been following the system because anybody who is following the system, who is using the system, gets the results from the system. Some of you have complicated your business. Complicated your business. You complicate this business when you refuse to use the system. Some of them are complicating your business. They don't talk. Don't talk. Don't try to explain. Why? Because you have not been trained. A time comes when you can do it. But that's, they say don't talk. That is the one you want to talk. Right? 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 Mimi, they told you to give that 72 hours. Is that the system we are using? Now you know. Right? Now you know. Even in the presentation, how to close, they tell you this is how to close. This is how to close. Some of you we are trying to close and your people. Some people will come and carry their prospect. They say, come. I come. You got. Somebody is trying to do close down. 
Somebody is trying to close down your, your prospect to pay instantly. To pay instantly. They are using the script to close down that. Somebody will come, some people will come and hey, 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 come, let us be going. I, the person is trying to say, no, don't worry, you will pay tomorrow. He can you can pay tomorrow. You can actually pay tomorrow. Me, I paid, I paid the next day. I didn't pay instantly. You are not using the system. Some people will come during presentation. Presentation is going on. Presentation is going on. They will come and sit down by the side of their prospect. And as the presenter is talking, as the presenter is talking, they are also doing their own presentation by the side. Uh -huh. You see, you need to pay now. Uh -huh. This one, that one, this one, uh -huh. the other one, the other one, the other one, the other one. Have you found out that all the people you were trying to close by yourself during presentation, none of them has paid? None of them has paid. <clears throat> You understand? You can't sit down. Connectors will be sitting there. They'll be touching their head. Hey, hey. You see that? He's saying, hey, hey. make sure I have pay, pay, pay. Go and pay. Ah, ah. You are complicating the business because do you know what? Do you know what? Do you know what? That's your prospect that you are talking to that way to get him to pay. He will also be thinking that that is how or what he must do to also get his own downlines. The professional, they tell you mastermind. Okay, go and meet the mastermind. One, two, three. Well, those of you who are for the mastermind, go and meet the mastermind and then the mastermind. So some of you will go, you say, come on, stand up, stand up, stand up. This one is my upline. This one is not mastermind editing. Come, 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 come. Be calm. Ah! Are you with me now? And that is why some people, are, you are not getting the results. Allow the professionals to do it. This is a system. This is how we can get people to make their payment. But as some of us, you are just busy. Come on now. You're not following the system. You are complicating the business when you don't follow the system. And you wonder why you are not getting the result. You wonder why you're not getting the result. You wonder why you are struggling. Follow the system. Use the system. Uh, listen, you... I don't know how to put this thing. This business is simple. This business is simple. This business is simple. When people come with your with your code, because you are not supposed see, you are not supposed to be the system. Don't be the company. Allow them. Let them let another person handle them. Handle them professionally. Handle them professionally. You are trying to help the system. You are trying to help the system. Say, this presenter is not doing a good job. Let me come and help the presenter. Let me come and be talking. It is through my talking that they are going to sign up. Who told you that? How many sign up have you gotten from that, that? What you should do, learn to refer the people back to the system. Learn to refer them back to the system. Learn to refer them back to the system. You are at home. Your prospect calls you. Your prospect calls you. And says, you know, help me to go to that to pay money to that we should pay. That we should pay. That if we don't pay now, we should not pay now. I say, eh, I see I, the truth is that uh, me, I am afraid of this kind of thing. You not tell the person, okay, anyway, uh, if you are afraid of come back home. Uh, me and you will go back there tomorrow and then you can you can make your payments. No problem. It's not forget the thing that said that you must not pay today. You can pay anytime, anytime, anytime. You can pay anytime. You can pay. You don't worry. I will help you get the mastermind. Don't worry. Ah, I, I will help you get the mastermind slot. And you are wondering why. You are wondering why. And you see that person you are talking to, the person is also learning from you. How many of you have noticed that um, <laughs> when somebody signs up, hmm? Hmm? You know when somebody signs up, have you noticed when somebody signs up by making a pay part payment of 5,000, have you noticed that most of his downlines or most of it will also be making part payment of 5,000? 5, <laughs> if somebody signs up for part payment, have you noticed that most of the people coming after that person will also be part, part payment, part, part payment? Do you understand? Are you following me now? Right? Are you with me now? So you need to follow the system. When somebody calls you, and tell you, I that please. They're telling me to pay. They're telling me to pay. He said, ah, they are telling you to grab the mastermind opportunity. And you are outside making call. You are supposed to be like, go and pray to be among those at the mastermind. You are not supposed to be calling me back now. You're not supposed to 
the economy. Go inside there. People are already grabbing the opportunity. You, your house, what are you doing outside making call? Go back there. Go back there. They are going to attend to all of your questions. You say, wait, I want to, I want to ask you some the people to answer your questions are inside the hall. Go back inside the hall. Go back inside the hall. They will attend to all. Refer them back to the system. Refer them back to the system. Refer them back to the tools. Or maybe you are in the office, the person you better came and met you outside. Alpha, alpha. Oh, I, I shouldn't be talking to you now. Go back inside. Go back inside. Come and follow everything they are telling you. Are you with me now? Use our system. If you use this system, you will get the result. You are planning home lunch. We told you, you don't need to cook food. You don't need to spend money trying to organize home lunch. You say, no, 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 no. Ha, I cannot invite people to my house and I don't have anything to present to them. No, when people come to my house, they need to know that it is my house they came to. You will kill turkey, you will kill chicken, you will kill, you will buy mud, you will buy wine, you will buy everything. You finish spending 500,000 naira to organize a home lunch. In fact, while the home lunch was going on, you were busy in the kitchen cooking. And as you are cooking, the words, the aroma of the food is even distracting the meeting. Because you want to show people that you came to my house. I'm not a poor person. Somebody has told me, I cannot what? Ha. Hmm? You say, I cannot, I cannot do what? I cannot invite people to my house and I don't give them anything to eat. Ha. Are you the system? And the aroma presentation is going on. Right. Somebody is thinking of what is cooking. Somebody is thinking. No wonder when we want to do what? When we want to do close down, they don't even do anything. We are telling you, are making your payment today. Today, When they call, I say, am I paying today? Am I paying today? Because what you were cooking was <laughs> is even distracting the presenter. <laughs> What you are cooking is even distracting the presenter. <laughs> Maybe the presenter just came back from China. You are not even eating lunch and came to come and run presentation for you. And what you are cooking is even is the, uh, all the enzymes are reacting. Use the system. Use the system. Don't be the system. Are you with me? There are some people, some of you right now, you know, people, when they come for your home lunch, Right? When they come for your home lunch, right? When they are done, when I say mastermind, you need to be part of those that the mastermind is going to work with. Make your payment today. Then your people will come and meet you. They will corner you one side. Say, half an hour. Must I pay this thing now? Must I pay? This thing is somehow, right? 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 This, this thing is somehow, this thing is somehow, like, you know that kind of thing. He just says, don't worry, don't worry. Don't. I, will, I will talk to them. I will talk. You got me. They say, this, this person is, is my best. This person is my person. Don't want this. He said he's going to pay tomorrow. He said he's going to. I know. And you are saying it in front of the prospect. I know him. No, this one, if he says anything, don't worry. He's going to bring it tomorrow morning. He's going to bring it. Some of you did today. Tomorrow morning never reach. So I will talk to them. Talk. The professional was trying to do his work. Right? The professional will be trying to do his work. Leave them to do the work. If they, if they say, ah. You see, there's nothing, there's nothing me. I am, I, they are the professionals who, they are the leaders of the, if they tell you that the, this is what the mastermind has said, please go back there. They are the ones that can solve your problem. It's not me that can solve your problem, right? I'm not the one that will solve your problem. Go and meet them. Go and beg them. Do you understand? Go and speak to them and let them be the ones. Do you understand? So if you are smart, you bring back, sir, sir, this is what this person is saying. Sir, I don't know what you can do for the person. Please, sir, that's why I brought, because you know me, me, I'm just me now. Me, I don't know anything. That's how to handle it. Be professional about it. Somebody finish wasting time. Not wasting time, though. Make gain out time coming to your house to come and run presentation. Then it is your lack of following the system that will not destroy everything. See, don't worry, they are my people. They are my people. Don't, if you say you will pay tomorrow, take you. You complicate the business when you are refusing to use the system. The ease. The... But some of us are complicating the system, complicating the business. And you know the funny part? That thing you are doing, they are learning it. They are also learning it. They are learning it. 
Listen to me. Duplication thrives on simplicity. Don't complicate this business. This business is simple. Stick to the system. Use the system. You will get the results. It is like mathematics. One plus one must be two. Right? 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 One plus one must be two. Must be two. Follow our system. If you are not getting your desired result, I said it before. If you are finding this business difficult, there is something you don't know or there is something you are not doing. There is something you don't know or there is something you are not doing. These are the two major causes of failure in this business. Duplication lies on simplicity. Leave this business to be simple. You don't need to spend money. You don't need to spend so much money for heaven's sake. So please, allow the system. Don't complicate this business. Don't complicate it for those who are coming. We know you are, you are a marketing director in your, in your office. You are, a market, you are a professional marketer. We know that. We know that that you can get people to sign up with whatever, whatever with that. Right? 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 Do you understand? Do you understand? Whatever is that? We know what. We say this is a marketing place. We know Cambridge. You know about marketing. Of course, we have a system here. Follow our system. Follow. The, it is simple. You see this one? You don't need to go to Cambridge. To succeed with it very simple just follow the simplicity it is plug and play plug and play but you are trying to you are, you are trying to you are trying to complicate it you are trying ha ah, say i'm helping my business my uh, home launch i need i must print out a word i must print an invitation card i must print an invitation card as if you are doing wedding to invite people for your home launch no wahala you can go ahead. You are very free. You are very free. You are very, very free. Go and do it. My own is gather people. When you finish, you now see the outcome of what you wanted to do. By yourself. How many of your downlines can print invitation card? That's the question. That's the question. How many of the people who sign up into your business, when you finish printing the invitation card, in fact, gold-plated invitation card, and you finish inviting all the people you are inviting, and then it is not time for them to do their home loan. How many of them can print a gold-plated invitation card? How many of them? That's the question. You see, you have just complicated the system. You have complicated the business. You, you can't duplicate. No, you can't duplicate like that. We say this is a. You see, we told this is our presentation slide. Follow this slide. Use it this way. This dress well, fine, good. Duplication thrives on simplicity. The final one, because of our time, I don't have time to explain everything. But let me just say, do what submit to mentorship. Hmm. I'm, just, I'm not going to write, say so many things about this. See, the second thing that will cause you to grow is submitting to mentorship. Hmm. This business is about leadership and mentorship. Who mentors you determines how far you go. The head over you, the head you are following determines how far you go. There are some of you there are some of you, there are some of you, your only problem is that you are not submitting, you are not submissive. Do you understand, right? You are not submissive, this is your problem. Some of you are like what? You are like, you are behaving like goats in this business. You are behaving like goats in this business. Very simple, follow there is somebody who has produced the result. Somebody has gone ahead of you. Somebody is already doing what you want to do. Follow the person's lead. Some of you, that is a problem for you in this life. You cannot submit. And I can tell you the truth. 
if you are struggling in this business, you are doing everything we told you to do. Like, I mean, you are using the system, you are using the, you are using the script, and yet you are struggling. Go and check, you are not submitting to mentorship. You are not submitting to mentorship. Mm -hmm. And the time you begin to have issues with mentorship, I promise you, your business will have a problem. No matter how good you are. You know, some of you, you are better than your upline. You are better than your upline leader by whatever par uh, um, parameters you're using. Maybe you are more education. Yeah. I'm going to myself. All right, you know, some of you, when you look at it, you look at the person who is ahead of you that you're supposed to, uh, you're meant to follow. You say, is this, this person I'm meant to be following? I'm more educationally qualified than this guy or this lady. Some of you, is even your problem, especially for the ladies. Maybe you are married, she's single. You say, this one, I'm more than her, I'm better than her. I am this one than her. And you are finding submission difficult, you will have problems. I'm not joking. You will have issues in your business. What does it mean to submit to mentorship? <laughs> Some of you don't. It, attending trainings is not submitting to mentorship. <laughs> attending trainings is not submitting to mentorship. Submitting to mentorship is submitting to instructions. You want to travel. Your mentor tells you don't travel. Will you obey? I mean your mentor in this business will your upline leader, your whoever leader, you call the person, sir, I want to go for a, a, an event in Susu and some place, and I want to be, you know, he says, no, you cannot go there. I want you to be at the office on Sunday because you need to do this, you're going to do this, you're going to do that. Will you stay back? That is submitting to mentorship. It is, <clears throat> because of time, this is this is just super Monday cell meeting. I will not have time, but let me tell you something. Submitting to mentorship means submitting your will, so long as this business is concerned, to that person who is watching over you. I'm not joking. Hmm. You say, I want to buy a car. I want to buy this type of car. Your mentor tells you, no, don't buy this car. Buy the other one. That is what it means to submit to mentorship. You know, some of us, you don't understand this, the power of mentorship. You know, some of us think that I submitted to mentorship just by coming from millionaire school, coming for this guy. I am submitting now. He's my mentor. He's the one mentoring me. Like, submitting to mentorship means that there is nothing you do without the knowledge and the approval of your mentor. Without the knowledge and the approval of your mentor. Some of you, you just, you just inform your mentor or your supposed mentor, right? Right? You have to do what? You have to submit. You have to submit. If you don't get the approval, you don't get the approval, right? You don't get the approval. You don't get the approval. If it doesn't give the approval, you cannot go anywhere. Do you know that it is as just, somebody somebody said does he does not like the language goods? Not be only he there for Bible. He there for Bible. The sheep and the goats, he there Bible, not be me the user. Jonathan, now do you know that it is as serious? It is as serious as even the issue of who to marry. Hmm. <laughs> Let me enter. Let me enter some people right now in this business. It, it is the issue of mentorship is as serious as the issue of what? As the issue of who to marry, when to marry. <clears throat> you don't understand this thing. You don't understand. If you have a mentor in this business, before you marry, you must go and submit to the mentor. Say, sir, ma, listen, oh. I have found somebody who I want to marry the best. 
I want to marry the person. And when is your, he says it's by next two months. They say, no, you can't, you can't, no, no, you can't marry this year now. You can't marry this year. <laughs> How many of you will agree? Say, listen, 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 listen. Is it because I gave you respect? I even came to inform you. Is it because I gave you, I gave you that respect? Do you think, who, who made you, who gave you a say in the issues concerning my decision? I will tell you why your mentor will have a say in the issue of even your life partner. I will tell you why. But all this, the only thing we will see, the only thing we will see is invitation card. Your wedding is two months to come. I'll be two weeks to come. In fact, one week to come. That's why uh, uh, sir, I came to I came to invite you to my wedding. I have told some of my leaders, I say, if you come, if what I am seeing from you is invitation card, I know they come. I will not attend that word. And I'm not joking. Especially if you are somebody I am mentoring or. I'm not saying it for everybody. Of course, I'm not mentoring everybody. But if you are one of the people I am mentoring, before somebody comes into your life, I should know. I should know. Or your mentor should know that I'm talking to the people I am mentoring. Please, I'm not the one mentoring everybody. Please, so before I will now start running a marriage counseling club here now. All right? That's, that's not what I'm saying. I'm saying that if I am the one that is mentoring you, I have to know. Do you know why? Do you know why? Let me tell you this. Let me tell you. Let me tell you why. Some of you don't know this aspect, but I'm saying it today because I came here to show. I said ease of doing business. Is that true? Very true. Do you know that there are some people because <laughs> let me say this to you. Do you know? You see this business? You see the kind of money we're making in this business, eh? See, you it is difficult to find people making this type of money somewhere else. Like with this is it is difficult. It is difficult. It is difficult to find people making this kind of money somewhere. So let me tell you the truth. The way when Nigeria economy is right now, people are also marrying for economic reasons. Let me tell you the truth. People are marrying for economic reasons. People are looking for somebody who will marry them to solve all of their economic problems. Hmm. And then you are a leader or you are not coming leader. Whether you are a male or female, you will come. You are doing a, you are doing a QSG. When you are doing QSG, you are showing people your DTC. Somebody is there. See millions in your DTC. Ah, The person say, I don't see him. I don't see him. This person has made 10 million. This person, you are showing people your alerts. You are showing people your alerts. You see, in one month, I make one million dollar or more. The guy is just looking at you. This is an answered prayer. All I need to do to make sure I don't remain poor in this life is to marry this guy, is to marry this girl. Once I marry him, once I marry her, all my financial problems are solved. Somebody is making one million. Before you know it, too, the person will start asking for mentorship. And the person is coming after you, not because the person loves you, but for what? But for what? But for economic reason, especially the ladies. Be very, very careful. You are very successful. Guys, I, they took now. They, they do for guess where get money. Right now. Ladies, I, they took these days. They are looking for guys where get money. And the kind of money we are making in this our business, you can't find it anywhere. So when they see you, you are busy showing people you are large, you are traveling up and down. You say, ah, this is, this is how to solve my poverty problem. So if I marry, you bring the money home now. You have to bring the money home. <clears throat> are you with me now? Are you with me now? So the person might just what? Might just be coming into your life just for the purpose of the money you are making. Hmm. 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 Before you know, they will start taking your picture to prayer house. They will start praying over. They will tell their I have found somebody. You have not found somebody. You found you found money. The person found money. You did not find somebody. That is why you must do what you must do. What you must submit. Your mentor should know. Your mentor should know. This is the person I am thinking. So I am going into a relationship with this person so that your mentor will begin to look. Go begin to look the person because you, 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 you that is talking. Love can blind you. Love is blind, but marriage opens your eyes. You don't know. 
So between that period, you are thinking that what? You do, a, you are thinking, ah, this person is the everything. Love, don't blind you. You need another person who can see beyond them. Somebody else that is not in love like you. You, you are in love. Your eye is blind. You don't know that this person is a predator. You need another person that is not in love to help you see. Are you with me now? To help you see. That's why you are telling your mentor. And this is strictly for economic purposes. Because you see, listen to me. I said, I will tell you why. I will tell you why you need to tell your mentor. Not your upline, though. I didn't say your upline. I did not. I say your mentor. That person you submit to. Now, the reason why I am bringing this into the issue of doing this, because... Somebody will be asking now, what does making have to do with marriage relationship? Let me tell you why. Right? Let me tell you why. Let me tell you why. You see, marriage is run by finance. Are you aware? Marriage is run by finance. You see all this love, 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 love. You are loving, 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 loving. When there is no money, love will fly out of the window. I'm not joking. I'm not joking. So it's not all about money. It's all about money. At least love, this thing makes it easier. Like, that's what I'm trying to say. When the, it is, it is, it is, it is beautiful. It is more beautiful. One year, two years, you could pay house rent. The second year, you couldn't pay house rent. Third year, you could that love will turn to frustration. I promise you, my brother. Stop blaming the lady. So marriage has is run by finance, very, very serious. So that means that, and anything that has to do with finance, you have to plan. Some of you, you don't get married because you are of age. You get married because you have set up systems and structures that can sustain the marriage. What is the need getting married, having a child, and you don't have the money to take care of that child? Will that child ever forgive you? This in this economy now, food to eat now, no be small something. You need to plan. You know one thing I have discovered: wealthy people plan. They plan when to marry. They plan when to give birth to children. I'm not joking. Everything is planning. Everything is planning. Is a poor man that doesn't plan anything. He knows how to give birth to children. Does not plan anything. You see somebody that just got married five years ago. You know, already has ten children. All of them. He's got. He's dying. Children everywhere. Hey, 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 hey. It's God that is giving children. It's God that gives children, but it is man that plans when they come. So that you will not put yourself under pressure. That is what we are trying to say. That is why you need to plan. Planning reduces pressure. Hmm. 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 You know, Shay, you heard it on Monday, I'll be on Tuesday. Sure, you, you heard it. Even your children, they are liability in terms of the expenditure, right? Liability. Is that not true? You have to plan. Plan when to get. You think it's, it's just love that you use and get married. How, what does it mean? You Okay, you finish saying you want to get married. You don't get money to run the to run, to run the world. See, listen to me. Let me say this. Let me let me say this. Let me say this. I, I didn't plan to say all of this, but maybe God wants to help somebody this morning. Right? God wants to help somebody this morning. Let me say this. If you are a connector, if you are a connector, now I am not promoting extravagance. I'm not trying to promote extravagance. But listen to me. If you are a connector and you are getting married, there is a level of wedding you should have. You should not be doing the same kind of wedding like any other person. Please, I am not promoting extravagance. Are you hearing me? I am not what promoting. I'm not saying because you should come spend 10 million. You are not impressing anybody. You are not. In. But what I am trying to say, the level of wedding you should have. What does this mean? As a connector, you should not be doing what? When you are planning wedding, you should not be running up and down looking for who will lend you money to plan your wedding. You just destroyed the prospect of your business. Did you hear me? Do you hear me? You should not be doing your child dedication. And you are telling people, please, please, 
Uh, I need to give me meat. I will pay you back after the child. I'm expecting people to come and spray money on me. When they spray the money, I will use it. Give me drink. I will pay you back. No, as a connector, you should not be doing that. You should not. Right? And those that have made a mistake, they, they, they are, you should build your business now to correct the mistake. I'm talking to those who are here to make the mistake. Do you understand? You should not be going and be telling people, give me meat, I will pay you back later. No, sir. It is not. See, do you know that people are watching everything you do? People know that you are doing this business. And they are looking at you. They say, ah, is it not this business you people say that people are making millions? You are not coming to come and collect. They may not tell you. They won't tell you. Do you they say, they say, ah, this is, this is, ah. And they say that you think tomorrow, if you come and tell the person, come and join, the, you think the person will say, no, there are certain things you, there is a standard you must set for yourself. As a connector, it is not every school you can take your children to. What I'm trying to say is that because you are a connector, because you planned your life, because you are created, there is a, set a standard for yourself. Set a standard for your family. That's what I'm trying to say. Plan. Don't rush to go and get married. Don't rush. And people have, that's what poor people do. Poor people put themselves under unnecessary pressure. Why? Because they don't plan. Because they don't plan. There is no planning. They don't do anything by planning. They just do it by what? By, 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 by how they feel. I feel it is time for me to get married. And they just go and get, and then they are disturbing. What will you, you it is you. Hmm. How many of you have discovered, you know, you know, when people, you know, some people tell you, uh, when you find the wife, it, it, it's a good thing, it brings favor, Abby. People will sponsor your marriage. How many of you have been disappointed? You were planning your marriage. You were expecting this person to give you money. You were expecting this other person to give it. When it was now time for you to marry, all the people you were expecting to give you money, he said, ah, if this person comes, he's going to give me so, so amount of money. On that day, the person did not even give you shishi. How many of you have noticed it? How many of you have noticed it? Eh? You have noticed it. You are planning something. You are depending on it. When that same person that told you, ah, don't you don't need to have money in the bank. Don't worry. Once you just find the wife, once you find the wife, favor will come. People will be dashing you money up and down, up and down. When you finish finding the wife, you are not looking for money. All the people that promise you, you are not seeing the money. And you begin to feel disappointed. You don't have a right to feel disappointed. Do you know why? When you say you are ready to marry, it means you are man enough. I can't, do you know what it means that you want to marry? That's why the Bible says you will leave your father and mother. Father and mother does not only mean your biological father and mother. Father and mother means anybody that has been supporting your living. Once you are ready to marry, it means that you are cutting off from them. You are saying, I am man enough to take care of my responsibility. <laughs> Getting married does not mean that you are in love. It means I can take care of my own responsibility. I don't need anybody. So why are you now feeling disappointed that they didn't give you money? You, they were not supposed to give you money. Now you, they marry, not be them, they marry. Their wife is not for both of you. Their wife is for you. It's for you, now your wife. So you have to carry it on your head. Stop getting angry with your family members that they did not support you. They were not meant to support you. You said you are man enough. You should be able to take care of it by self, yourself. Are you seeing it now? Do you not see why you should tell your mentor, I, I want to get married? <clears throat> your mentor will ask you, how much are you already making from this business? That's our job. That's my job. How much are you already making? Yeah, you are struggling. Last month you made 150,000. The other month you made 32,000. The other, other, other month you did not make any money at all. Then this month you are making 72,000. You want to go and bring somebody to take care of the person. Bros, bros, no, no, no. You can't get married at this level. Do you see it now? You see it now? So you need a balance. Do you see it now? So that is why, that is why. And you for the ladies, they say you want to go. We have to check this guy, this guy, this guy that is coming. We have to be sure. 
We have to be, is this guy coming for you or actually just be, see, listen, to, I don't want to give people examples. There was this guy, the, Kai, do you know, do you know, there was this guy that came for presentation. Let me just give you this example, right? <clears throat> right? Now, there was this guy that came for, that came for business presentation in Abuja. Mm -hmm. And before you know it too, after QSG, the guy started following a uh, Ronke. Ambassador Ronke. I love you, I love you. I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you. I love you, I love you, I love you. They say, hey, you love me. Oh yeah, come and see my mentor. She brought him to Ambassador Mike. She brought him there. Before we tell you whether I love you back, you must see my mentor. She brought him to her mentor. You know, there's one thing about mentorship. They don't see things. So. The guy, but somebody saw the guy, he just knew that this guy is a gold digger. He told her, okay, you can't go into this relationship. And because he told her, you cannot go into this relationship, she told the guy, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, no, we can't do anything. I can't, we can't do anything. Right? It's not possible. Before you need, since Ron Kelly refused, the guy started checking Didi Mala. The same guy, yo, the same guy, he know to tell, he has started chasing Didi Mala again, trying to date both upline and downline at the same time. Trying to, that's the guy that I love you, I love you everywhere. I love you, I love you everywhere. Trying to date both upline and downline. You see, you see, you see. There are, there are things we see. There are things we see in this business. It's not everybody you forget to. It's not everybody. That's why you have to submit. That's why you have to let them know. That's why you have to let them know. Because they can guide you. We are not saying we are going to be choosing your... Please, so me, I know Sabi choose anybody's life partner. But at least in the, in the multitude of counsel, there is what? Safety. Me, I am more concerned about the economic well-being of your family. I am more concerned about that. The economic well-being of your family. A lot of families, they have divorced because there was no money to take care of responsibilities. And if you don't plan yourself, you place yourself under pressure, unnecessary, preventable pressure. Listen to me. There is no rule as to when you must get married. There is no rule. There is no rule as to when you must get married. Omo, everybody that wants to get married will get married, but they'll get married in their time. And at the end of the day, you go still born people, you go still get children. Which one is better? That you married at 25 and you struggle and struggle and struggle and struggle and struggle all through that marriage. Or, or that you marry at 30, you, de you, you delay it, married by 30, and by the time you are a better father, you are a better mother. Which one is better? Which one is better? Hmm. Let me... Let me let me let me bring this meeting to a close, please. People should not provoke me. I need to bring this meeting to a close. But I hope that the word you've heard, you see, the ease of doing business. Some people right now have struggled and are struggling in their businesses because of unnecessary relationship. There are some of you right now, you are supposed to concentrate and be building your business, but there is one guy that is disturbing your life, and the guy is not even ready. He's not ready. Why is he disturbing you? Why is he distracting you? You as a guy, rather than you to focus on your dream, build your life. Build your life. You are busy chasing, 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 chaser. And you don't have... You don't know that this thing can distract. You don't know that this thing can distract. When it is that, focus, pursue your dream. Build, become a quality person. The right people will come. The right people will come. Is it not wrong care that is not married? Is it not Didi Mwala that is not married? Are you with me now? See, marriage is not an achievement to... 
Let me tell you the truth. Marriage is not an achievement. Too. It's not. It's not. It's not an achievement. It's a blessing. And it comes. You see, say God's time is the best. When a blessing comes, it comes at the right time. It's not an achievement. It's not an achievement. It's not an achievement. So all these things, all these people, all these people are just distracting you, distracting you, distracting you, and you cannot focus. Focus on your dreams. Your dreams and your life purpose is more important. Some people, because of they have past mentorship. I just wanted to tell you how much the issue of what in mentorship. That is how serious mentorship. So uh, submitting to mentorship doesn't necessarily mean because you attend. I, I come from you. That's not submitting to mentorship. It is you even submitting your will for this person. I know how many things I wanted to do. I remember the first time I wanted to buy land. I said, I want to go and build a house. I told Ambassador Mike, Ambassador Mike, said, you are not here ready. He said, don't do that. And that was how immediately he said, the thing deleted from my brain. Forgot about it. Went and built my business. Now the time finally came. No stress. That's what it means to submit to mentorship. He said, I want to do this. This is my downline. Is this. Then I want to. You have to let him know. Submitting to mentorship is what? Getting, informing your mentor and getting the approval of your mentor. Now, of course, there are some people who try to do what? Try to, who try to, um, what do I call it? Bully the people that mentor. Now, mentorship is not by force. Are you aware? One person must not mentor you. There's no only one mentor. Do you understand? When you have somebody who is not interested in your growth, you can have another person mentor you. That is the truth. That is the truth. Right? Uh -huh. Are you understanding me now? But of course, before you do what? Before you get to a higher level of mentorship, make sure you have gone through the lower level of mentorship. Because as I'm talking about mentorship right now, some people are reading, boss, you are the one that will mentor me. You are my mentor. I want you to be my mentor. Before we be your mentor, your other mentor must have mentored you. Some of you like to jump your, your leader because you don't have issues, you have issues with them. You want to jump there, you want to come and create work for me to be mentoring you because me, I'm jobless now. Not true, Charlie, but like, come on now, imagine me mentoring everybody in Ativa's team. I go die before my time now. You have to prove yourself faithful in little. The higher level of mentorship will call you. It's not you that will call them. Mm -hmm. The higher level of mentorship will call you, not you calling them. So let me say this, even as I bring this to a close. You must do everything possible to make sure that you are in good terms with your mentors, no matter how they make you angry. Listen to me. Your mentor is not your friend. He might be joking with you. He might be laughing with you, but your mentor is not your friend. You must know that. You must know that. So no matter what happens, you must make sure that you are in good terms with your mentor. Even if your mentor made you angry, you must forgive you. It's for your own good. I'm telling you the truth. You must forgive for your own good. Make sure you are always in good terms with your mentor. Make sure. Make sure. Don't you? There's nothing like I am quarreling with my mentor. <clears throat> There's nothing like I am quarreling with my mentor. He did what I don't like. Because of that, I will not talk to him again. Whose pocket? Whose pocket? <laughs> you don't understand this thing. You don't understand this thing. You don't understand. So you must have a good relationship with the people who are above you in the business. Whether they're directly mentoring you or not, you must have a good working relationship. That doesn't mean you must like them. You don't need to like them. You don't need to like somebody to have a good working relationship with the person. Are you with me now? But the word there is what? Submit. Submit to mentorship. I hope we got value today. Wow, I took I taking so much time this morning, but I believe we got value, right? I believe we got value. So, guys, tonight is going to be our celebration. We're going to be celebrating our achievers in the month of August. People who did what 
people who proved beyond reasonable doubt why they actually succeeded. So this night we are going to be what we are going to be. We are going to be celebrating each and every one of them. Make sure that you are available. Make sure that you are there to cheer your people on. Some of them are your downlines. Some of them are your uplines, right? Make sure you are around to cheer them up. Make sure you are around to cheer them up. 7 p.m. is the time. Make sure you are not missing, right? Everybody in your team has to be around tonight. It's going to be a wonderful, wonderful, what? wonderful session, all right? So see you by um, by 7 p.m. tonight. Take care of yourself. Thank you very much. And have a very, very fruitful week. Make sure you have a very fruitful week this week. Make sure you produce, right? Make sure you produce. Goodbye, everyone. Thank you.